it's your girl Gladys aka is that your hair and welcome back to my channel if you're new here tap that subscribe button hit the notification bell so that you don't miss anything coming up and if you've been rocking with me for a minute what's up what's good and welcome back today is $20 Tuesday $20 Tuesday is a special time on my channel where I showcase super cute yet super affordable wigs for the lovely $20 price range and below so let's just jump right in I haven't done that intro in a while. What's up, y'all? How's everyone feeling? Come on in, premiere party if you're watching with me. What's good? Hello. First, I wanna thank you all for showing me love on the past two videos I've done. I did do a life update type of video where I talked about the struggle of being a content creator. And I also dropped a video yesterday on Misha 208. So make sure you check out those videos. They'll be linked in my description box down below. But today we're gonna get into a little $20 holla from Sensational, and this is Sensational Zanaya. I remember first seeing Zanaya on my girl Shanice Nicole, and I was like, I need that wig! But I never got her, until now. Saw her on wig type, she was like $25, something like that, and I decided to pick her up. I must say, she is cute! <laughs> But everything's not perfect, so let's just start with the specs. This unit does come with your typical cap construction, your two combs in the front, comb in the back, adjustable straps. This is a lace front wig, and it has a set part. So this part in the middle, you can't move it. I mean, you can move the wig to the side if you want a side part, but I decided to keep it in the middle because I really like it this way. I would say this texture, Fresh out the pack, it's like in between like a silky and yakky texture, more on the silky side. But as you wear it, it will definitely feel thicker. As far as the length on my 5'3 frame, it definitely falls pretty long on me. I actually ended up trimming this a bit, so it was maybe an inch longer. So I would say this is about 24 inches or so curled. Now I know I normally come on and style the unit on camera, but y'all, these days, y'all know I'm slowly getting back onto YouTube. And <laughs> I got this new setup and I, I had to switch some things around. So it's been taking me a little bit longer to record until I get back in my groove. So I was like, you know what? I just want to put the wig on and come on camera and just talk to my people. I hope y'all are okay with that. If you're not, please check out all of my other videos on my channel. I have a wig 101 playlist where I showcase how to make your wigs look natural. I have so many videos on that topic, so definitely check out that playlist if you are new to Is That Your Hair. Now, as far as the pros to this unit, I would say main pro would be the style. I think this, this classic barrel style, you just can't go wrong with it. I love it, I think it looks beautiful. And I like the way the part lays, and of course the price, I love it. $25 and you get this beautiful style, you cannot go wrong. This is definitely the type of hair that you would wear out on a nice date with your boo, your bae, your partner. You can go out with your homegirls, maybe a nice little brunch. I know we've been quarantined for a while, but you know, it's starting to get a little warm outside. Keep it cute, keep it safe, wear a mask. But yeah, I think this would be great to take out on the town. Now, I actually did wear this wig already one time. Normally when I come on here, I'm reviewing wigs fresh out the pack, but I loved her so much out the pack, I was like, I'm wearing her now, cause C and I had like a little date night. And this is where the cons come in. <laughs> I noticed after wearing her for about five hours, there was definitely a lot of tangling, especially starting at the nape area. Now keep in mind, this is a synthetic wig and it's on the lower end. So we're not talking like premium fibers here. So you're going to get tangling, you're going to get some shedding. Definitely more tangling on this unit than shedding though. And then because it's a long synthetic unit, my goodness, I mean, this is a nice tangle city. But when it comes to my $20 units, my expectations are normally low and I know what to expect with this type of hair and texture. So it wasn't a huge deal to me. Plus I know that because of what I was wearing that night, I had on like a fur and that definitely enabled the tangling. That's something you need to keep in mind with synthetic wigs. You know, we're wearing like cotton blends and wool, sweaters, things like that, furs. That is like the nemesis to synthetic wigs. Synthetic wigs don't like that type of material. It just gets caught and snagged and pulled and tugged and these are not real human hair fibers, so the wear and tear is real, okay, on Zanaya. And this is how she's looking in the back. <laughs> you see these ends? This, this is what was going on with Miss Anaya after I went out <laughs> with C. And it was worse than this, but I actually um, tried to repair her a bit 
off camera. Pretty much what I did was I, let's say I took this section here. I would start off by brushing it out with the paddle brush. Ooh, Lord, y'all hear that? <laughs> and then I would use this product right here. I absolutely love this product. I've talked about it several times on my channel and a lot of y'all bought this product because I mentioned it. This is the Simply Styling Silk Spray. This is great for synthetic wigs because it helps diminish tangling. Now, it does not prevent tangling altogether, but it will help diminish it. So when you have tangling that's happening, when you spritz on the silicone, it acts as a barrier, as a protectant for the synthetic fibers. So when I spritz that on, ooh, it's still, it's still, ooh, this is rough. I might need a little bit more. <laughs> and I comb through it, it becomes easier to comb through. Another thing that I would do with something like this, you could also apply heat and you could also recurl it. I know I've never shown that on my channel, but maybe I will one day. Normally, I'd be kind of lazy. <laughs> but there are definitely lots of videos on how to recurl synthetic wigs on YouTube. So yeah, I would do that. But if you look here, you can see that it's a bit tethered already. See those fibers? The heat will straighten out these fibers but it won't take care of it forever. At the end of the day, this is synthetic, so you have to do what you can in order to get the most wear out of it. That's one question that I hear a lot. It's like, how do I make my synthetic wigs last longer? Y'all, there are so many factors when it comes to that. The hair texture, normally yakier textures last longer. The hair length. I have synthetic bobs that I've worn countless times and they're still going strong because they are a bob. They don't have to deal with my sweater, my shirts, or things that I wear. They don't have to worry about my clothing items pulling on the fibers of the wig. Just keep in mind that for 20 something dollars, this right here, Ms. Anaya, is a look. I think she's super pretty. I am ready to go somewhere in her. <laughs> Where's my mask at? <laughs> and I will cop her. She actually reminds me of another wig that I reviewed from Sensational Trissa. And actually, Sensational Trissa and Zanaya are from the same line, the Empress line. One thing you should know about that line, though, are the caps are normally smaller. I don't know what it is about the Empress line. Maybe it's for the small head girls. I don't know. You'll see here, like, you know, I'm a medium-sized head. It's, it's coming down a bit over here, but over here, uh, like, not so much. I don't know. But I don't mind too much. It doesn't feel uncomfortable on my head. If you have a larger head, it might be a different story. But yes, y'all, that's all I have for Ms. Anaya. Let me know in the comments down below if you like her, if you would cop her. If you're interested in Sensational Trissa, I will link that video down below as well. And if you are new to Is That Your Hair, make sure you tap that subscribe button, hit the notification bell so that you don't miss anything coming up. Again, I wanna thank you all so much for the support that you all have been pouring into me since I've been away. I'm so excited, so happy to be back, so just, I just really feel the love, y'all. I really feel the love. Y'all have been binge watching my content. I mean, it's awesome. It's now March and I feel like my year is low key starting over. Is it just me? <laughs> I'm like, girl, we, we are three months in. Let's get it the fuck together. <laughs> but it's all good. Make sure you check out my latest videos over here on the side of me and I will see you all in the next video. Bye.